Praise the Lord, today is October 26th. And if you can, I want you to try to remember a time where you had someone that you knew, someone you were associated with. Maybe you were really close with them, maybe you weren't close with them, but you knew each other. And just one day out of the blue, they walk right by you like you weren't even there. It's almost like they just kind of shook you off from their life and cut you off. They ghosted you. Um, they walked right by you. It was like you didn't even exist. And I want you to think of that pain that you felt where you were kind of like, wow, why did they do that? Why did they just walk right by me and completely ignore me like I didn't even exist? Like, I am... I'm not even a human being, like I'm just a puff of smoke, or not even that, right? Well, it's similar to the Lord and us Christians celebrating Halloween. You see, in Matthew 27, when Jesus was crucified, he had his arms stretched out like this on the cross. And when our Lord, our precious Lord and Savior died, in that moment, the veil was torn in the temple, okay? And when that curtain was torn, that was a symbolism of our Heavenly Father on the throne in heaven with His arms outstretched to us, right? Opening His arms so that we could go into him and have a very intimate fellowship, a very intimate relationship with him. Thanks be to Jesus Christ, right? He opened that that door up opened it up for us so that we can have a very intimate relationship with him. And we walk with him, right? Day after day after day, we we he's holding our hand, right? But what happens on October 1st for the Christians who celebrate Halloween? What do they do? They shake their hand away from the Lord, right? And then they just kind of go off and do their own thing. And the Lord is standing there feeling how we did when that person or those people walked by us and made us feel like we didn't exist right they just kind of shook us off like we weren't there like they completely forgot about us maybe they maybe it was a pastor maybe it was a spouse maybe it was a friend or a co-worker bottom line is that it hurt right it kind of crushed us that someone could do that and if you've never had anyone do that to you well, praise the Lord, but I bet you could imagine, right? So I want you to imagine the Lord feeling the exact same way October 1st through Halloween, October 31st, okay? That's what, that's what Christians are doing during that time, right? They're kind of saying, oh, off with you, Lord. I'll see you November 1st, right? The Lord wants to fellowship with us intimately. Jesus Christ died so we can have that eternal, intimate fellowship with He and our Heavenly Father for eternity. But for the entire 31 days of October, there are Christians who walk away from that intimate fellowship with the Lord, right? It's heartbreaking for our Heavenly Father. He wants us to turn back to Him today and not turn away from Him another day in this dark month. Turn back to Him. Seek His intimacy again. Ask His forgiveness. He'll welcome you with open arms. Arms full of forgiveness, love, and mercy because that's who He is and He loves us so much and that's all He wants is our time, our attention, our love and devotion to Him, right? God bless.